Hello everyone, Bethany here. I have the next unboxing from Bella Art Day Nicole. In this order, I ordered a three divider diamond painting stackable tray in pearl red and an ombre colored stackable tray, uh, a large size in ombre. They started doing these ombre ones and I am really excited to see what one I got and how it turned out. As far as the pearl red, one of my late grandmothers, um, who I absolutely adored, her name was Pearl, and, so, and her favorite color was red. She liked bright reds, bright oranges. So I really wanted to order that when I saw it in honor of her. I wish that she was still around to see this diamond painting art. I think that she just would have loved the beauty of it. Um, she wasn't really a crafty person, so I don't think she would have, I don't know if she would have done it herself. She might have helped me from time to time. That would have been cute. But I think that she would have been a huge fan of watching me do it, which I just love the thought of. But who knows? She was really into flowers and gardening and, she, and baking. Oh my gosh, she was the best bake and best cook that I've ever known. But anyways, let's get into this. La. We have their card. Bella Art Day Nicole, turn over. Bonk. QR code. Oh, I got a sticker with this one too. Ooh, that is pretty. That is pretty. Butterflies with diamonds. That event, they're no longer doing that event. But I got one of the last stickers. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty. It's green. Oh, I like that one. I like how it goes from the dark to the light. That's, that's cool. This, I forgot that she was sending this. This is a replacement for the one. If you watch one of my previous videos, you'll see that in one of them, my rose gold tray had a defect in it. Um, and so she sent me a replacement one for that. Awesome. She said I could keep the defected one since it was just on the end. I might still be able to use it. Well, I'm letting my daughter Lavender use it. Gave it to her and she loves it. She, you know, she, she doesn't know any better. So it works pretty good. This is my replacement one for that. Awesome. Ooh, that is cool. Okay. I don't know if it's going to show up on the camera or not, but there is a slight sparkle to it. There's little bits of like silver in there or something. Three divider tray. You have your dividers that go in or out. These are quickly becoming my new favorite. Now the large size is typically the ones that I like the best because you can fit more diamonds in them but they're small enough to hold. I do like the max trays but these ones I think are one of my favorite ones because they hold even more than the large tray. I'll take some of the lids off so you can see better. Christmas colors. <laughs> um, they hold more than the large trays. Oh, the large ones do have an extra line there. I feel like they hold a little bit more than the large trays. They're some, because they're thin, they're small enough to just hold like this. And I like to take the divider trays out and just use them like that. I think it's great. But I do like to use it with the dividers in there too. All right, well, do you guys want to see me put some diamonds in here? Yeah, let's do it. You can see that you, I'll show you the differences between all the trays. We'll do, we'll do a small one. I've already done an unboxing of the rose gold, but you know, what? it's a, it's okay. It's good to, it's good to test these things out. I already know the trays are going to work just fine. Shake it up, tap it, tap it. 
if you tap it on this, if you, the tapping it this way will get them lined up. If you tap it this way, it makes them straight. So if you're using a multi-placer, that's really key because you want all of them to be on the same page, if you know what I mean. And if you don't know what I mean, well, maybe that's an idea for another video. All right, so that's the small tray. Let's go to the large one. Looks like we're gonna do a red. I'm just kind of randomly grabbing diamonds from the current project that I'm working on. Now I have a few more ombres, ombre trays coming. Did I just, I swear one just jumped out. Okay, I must be seeing things. Um, I have a few more ombre trays coming. So I'm excited to see what colors I got for, for the order as well, but I do really like this one. Pretty. So if you want, when you're pouring these out, you can use the, you can use the lid or not use the lid. Totally up to you. Um, it will help keep them from flying out. I like to just tap them down to the bottom to begin with and then I don't have a problem with that usually. So, but it's up to you how you do it. I mean, you can just put the lid on when they're all up here. You can just put the lid on and then just maybe that works. I don't know. I've never done it that way. All right, so with this three stacker, you can do, you can choose to do one color. You can choose to do two colors, either that way or that way, up to you. Or you can do three colors, which is pretty awesome. Let's go ahead and show you what I'm talking about. So put some gray in that one. We will put some red, if I can open the bag, some red in the middle. And normally I would probably pour more diamonds in there than this, but you know, and it will do a dark gray. But, um, you know, I don't want to spend all this time on the video putting the diamonds back into the K, into the thing, so I'm not using a whole lot. So and then you can shake it up. If you're nervous about them jumping around, because I, I suppose that is possible, then I would recommend just putting the, putting the lid on. Oh, see what I did? I hit, I hit that and all those red ones. All those red ones made a jump for it. Which, I mean, if something like that happens, it's not too difficult to fix. Okay, unless, they're, unless they have static and they want to be a pain. I really like it though. Okay, let's see if this works. We want to shake it that direction because that's where the, we're going to line them up. Okay, um, so most of them I flipped over, not all of them. Let's try this tapping thing. Yep. So that's not too bad. That's definitely workable. Um, if you're single placing, which is probably most often gonna be the case if you're using the different colors because it's gonna be confetti, maybe not, but quite often, then it's not gonna matter too much if they're all perfectly lined up. It is a little bit difficult to do. but still very doable so you do want to make sure that this is on in the grooves properly and slid properly and if that's on there when you pour them down it they're not likely to jump ship from one spot to another 
these I think are really staticky because they're not really cooperating very well. And if you have really staticky drills, there's a couple of, of things you can do about that. You can use dryer sheets, little pieces of dryer sheets, cut them up, put them in either your baggies or um, your trays, or you know, I've seen I've seen people do it on the bottom of the tray. Um, I've seen people do it at the top of the tray. I've seen people just run them over the drills a little bit. The other thing you can do is put your drills in the freezer. Yes, the freezer. Put them in the fr put them in a freezer. Get them. Those ones don't want to leave. Get them nice and cold um, for a little while, and that should help take ri rid of the static as well. Science. Okay. There are two drills here. They are being, they are being absolutely rebellious. I got him. At least one of them, I think. Did I get, nope. See? Oh my goodness. I tell ya. The <laughs> yeah, oh my goodness. Okay. Um, this hour, this video is going to be several minutes long just because I'm trying to get this drill. Oh my goodness. I wasn't crazy. Look. Remember when I thought that drill escaped? I thought I saw a drill fling out, but I couldn't find it, so I thought I was losing it, but I wasn't. Okay, next color is red. Make sure there's none in that section. There's not, but there is a red. That's kind of, okay. Make sure this is covering that part. Pull this up, shake it down. Now they do kind of get stuck on these, so you'll just want to make sure that that's not happening. See if we have any better luck getting all the red ones in there. Yep. Totally great. This one I need to, I think it's from this other bag that I had out, so let's go ahead and check yep yeah same color as that one so all right um we have one more to put away so for the last one none of this other stuff matters just take out the divider whoops slide them on down Put them away and that is that so those are my trays that I got with this order so pretty all right guys I'll see you on the next video bye